My name is Sarah and I'm an Alta student, level three. My piece for you is the potential that everyone saw but me. From as far back as I could re recall my school days, I was good at blending in so well that my teachers didn't think I needed help. A simple thing as long division, I never understood how to do because I couldn't understand what I had read. Then, term after term, my grades fell, all because I was afraid to ask for help. My mother got discouraged with me and wasn't able to continue sending me to school. I wasn't showing any improvement and all I wanted to do was play. As a young child growing up, all the children from the area were in school. I was the only one at home passing my time in the ravine and the drains, catching fishes until my cousins reached for home from school. Then I would be elated to see my cousins. Most times I would be turned away because they had their homework to do and I was told to go home and pick up a book. They would also say, try to learn something rather than playing all the time. This went on for years until everyone had their summer jobs and I had to resort to making a day's work for a farmer, all because I wasn't in school. The work in the garden some days would be very strenuous compared to the summer jobs my cousins had. They were all able to hang out after work, but I would have to get enough rest to go another day. It was not that I needed the money, it was just so that I had a job too. As time went by, my sister started working in the airport. While making a purchase, my sister was approached by the shopkeeper that they were looking for an extra help. They wanted to know if she knew anyone. She told me about it and I went for the interview and started working two days per week. While working there, I made many friends who were surprised to learn that I didn't make it past primary school. They were all encouraging me into going back to school because they saw I had a lot of potential. After many years, I was also told that I had the aptitude for learning. Education had never been a thought of mine until I heard about Alta in 2014. I made the decision day and then that I had to do, I had to want change for myself. I told my family and they motivated me to get started. I joined Alta and started their classes. There, the tutors were very encouraging and loving towards teaching. I was, I was convinced that I had made the right choice. One of my heart's desires was to work with young children. I have been taking one course at a time and with God's grace, I have been persevering and accomplishing my journey in education. Literacy, I didn't think it was as important as starting this program. When I now started this program, it was just because I wanted to be able to read and write properly. When I started doing the program and I realized I would change my life and impacted my everyday life, it's like it included in every day. And when I now started, I used to be embarrassed. Like if somebody would say, um, where are you going? I would say to class, to go say, well, what class are you taking? I would be embarrassed to say it's a literacy class. And now that I'm in it, I'm so proud of myself and who I have become that it had no shame in learning because when you go somewhere and you can't fill out a form, you just be more embarrassed. And the kind of confidence and the kind of excitement you just feel that you don't need no assistance to fill out a form or you, if somebody asks you a question that you could answer, the simple things, reading and writing, you had to want that for yourself. And you had to make that start. We just have time for everything else, but it's our time to make time for yourself and make education part of it.